Maybe blue build. It's been a while. I'm gonna get like a first item ignition tank or some shit. It took me forever to come around on earning, and now she's my favorite. She is so good. She gets kind of a bad rap, I think. I talk about this every time I play her, but a lot of players just don't really like her that much, unfortunately. Dude, crowbars would be cool. It would be better with the uh, ice sphere, though, I think. Tendrils kind of take away the crowb a little bit. I like my key, though. You prefer Artie's ults over default skills? A lot of them, in some ways, sure. It's really on the preference, so for the most of the time, anyway. If you know how to play Artie, you know. You take anything and win, so just use what's fun. She just like the executes are just so fun to play around, honestly. The ice wall is really the the main part of her kit, which is why it's crazy. I don't need two keys. It's crazy to me that people uh, don't use it. Oh, we have a uh, we have a scrapper sort of thing. The the sooner you play around the ice, the better you'll be. It's about doing some big AOE stuff and then having it all disappear in a flash. Let's get some opal seed. I saw working on Mythrax, yeah, I mean, with Ice Spear and Snap Freeze, you can pretty much just, uh, perma-stun Mythrax forever and then win. I'll get the opals in a second. Might take another Crowbar. Usually, I don't really like Feather on Artie, because it kinda it ends up playing weird. Every time I'm trying to float down with Ion Surge, it's, like, annoying, but I'll take it. Love the floaty lass. Yeah. The only thing I don't like about her that much is her acceleration. So if you go this way, uh, you have to really like turn around. See how Artie's model slowly turns? Yeah, there's a, a stat for that. Just... <laughs> it's meh. She was actually my second Eclipse Climb as well. I always liked the idea of Artie, but when I first started this game, I was pretty bad with her. She was very different to play, and, um, you know, I just didn't really put a lot of time into, into practice in her until I started doing Eclipse. And it was during my Eclipse Climb that I just, like, realized how much I love this character. Other godsend for Flame Authority? Yeah. Very different. <laughs> After beating EA, she's probably my most consistent character. Yeah. I think she's one of the most consistent characters in the game, for sure. I think that's pretty fair to say. She just has that kind of build, you know? Hey there, buddy. Guillotine is useless on her, though, so... She comes with pre-post skip from Freeze, Fae, 4, in her kit. It's crazy strong. She can deal with so many enemies so easily. She's like a... Almost like a ranged loader. Not quite as much as uh, Railgunner is, but... Before Railgunner existed, Artie was kind of it, right? She was your... She was your loader in the sky. Oh, here's the quote. Remember that... Although Ion Surge keeps Artificer out of the way of most enemies, flying monsters will pose an even bigger threat than usual. Why? Why? Who wrote that? Someone Ion Surge into a bunch of wisps in the sky and then died and was like, holy shit, this character sucks. When facing a flying enemy high in the sky, Snap Freeze is completely ineffective. Charged Nano Bomb requires a direct hit to explode, and Flame and Plasma Bolt deal comparatively low damage. Dude, is that not the craziest thing you've ever heard? With normal, like, actual logic, you just assume, yeah, when facing a flying enemy, not in the sky, uh, all those things also apply. It's, it's not that hard. You wanna know a tip? If you can't hit your shots, uh, maybe use Ion Surge and get close, and then maybe you can hit your shots. Also, interesting note, why wasn't Flamethrower mentioned in that? The, the ability with limited range, that sometimes just can't hit flying enemies depending on the terrain or the boss type, like Z Construct, if it flies just a little bit too far. Well, what about what about that flying tip in the, the get fucked tip section? I don't know. That is being used to say Ion Surge is bad. Just put that in perspective, right? That's the craziest thing I've ever heard in my life. It's crazy how that exists on a wiki for a game. I need to add that to like a copy paste command though, like a like a copy pasta thing, because that's like a that's like a level of like parody that can only be done with like a, you know game journalists or something. I mean, like here's the truth though, like there's always like a conversation around uh, Iron Surge versus Flamethrower. Well, I'm gonna give you the actual truth. It uh it doesn't matter which one you use, and if you need to rely on one or the other. Uh, you don't know how to play art if you're like really upset. 
about someone using one or the other. Uh, maybe time to learn already a little bit more. But I like movement, so I answered is more fun for me usually. Yeah, was, uh, there used to be a lot of those. There was even more batshit crazy stuff on the arty section as well. It was one that said uh, you need to get stun grenades on arty. When your M2 always stuns and or freezes, when you have a freeze shift always, when for most enemies your M1 will stun them like that. Um, and you wanna know why? Because whoever wrote it liked using flamethrower. And just said like, hey, you need to use stun grenades on Artie, no matter what. That one's removed though, I think. I think we made fun of that one too hard and someone took it down. GG. I don't really need the feather because it's Artie, so it's kind of why I went in on them there. Fans will do more for us. I actually wanted a green, but that's actually really good for Artie. So we'll take it. Faster nanobombs, Pog. It's more about the snap freeze. You can keep Mithric stunned for longer. Hey. This is suddenly a pretty good run. Jar's Bane is so good for RD2 because we can keep Mithrix in place and then blast them and get the full effects of Jar's Bane. It's nuts. He makes use of bands real well. I need speed though. Could have kept my feather if I wanted to, but this is way better. Hell no. Win rate? Yeah, I've never won, sir. I'm still working on my first win right now. I like Sticky Bomb on Artie. It makes me happy. Uh, let's get out of here, shall we? Dude. How you're beating airborne enemies with Iron Surge without movement speed? Dude, I'm cheating or something. I have god mode on, I just didn't show it. Alright, let's get rid of some stuff. You did not crit. I don't think it would have one shot anyway, but... On the moon. We got the cave in a void seed. Maybe some good stuff. I love sticky bombs. Let's try to get like an ATG or something soon, so maybe we could take even further advantage of it. It taunts me. Should have taken Fire M1, idiot. <laughs> I love the area of this one, especially with stuff like rock items. Come back, maybe get a recycle. Actually, we don't have an equipment, man. It's stage four, is the first equipment we found. Then you don't take it, you get it. I mean, it's it's only a green, so you're gonna get it pretty often, but yeah. It's also true. Fire already is so fun with ignition tanks, so holy shit. If that thing lasers me, by the way, I instantly die. Please kill it. Thanks. Well, that's good for a sticky bombs, I think. We'll roll with it. No collapse counterplay exists other than one running away. That is not true, actually. Blast shower exists. Last shower cleanses it. If you have iframes, you can counter it, like Merc or Huntress or something. If you're Veen, you can cleanse it with your shifts. It has a lot of counterplay, actually. More than most things. Brain coat as well. Sure. It's just kind of like a weirder uh, overloading, honestly. What do we want to see here as far as uh, equipment goes? I mean, what am I saying? You already know the answer. Dude, I just crit so many times. I know I have Clover, but... I don't have that much crit, so... There you go. Mm, that's really good. Until we get our ICBM, then the other one's better. Uh, what do we want here? A little bit more crit would not be bad, but we want those shurikens. A band, you say? Finally, an ice band, dude. There's a scrapper. Also, very nice. This stage is gonna be kinda stacked, man. Oh, I see a large damage chest. That's for sure gonna give me something good and not really weird and bad, right? Not bad like a squid polyp or a guillotine or a death mark, right? Alright, there we go. Good. I didn't know if I was gonna get that or not. I was just waiting. <laughs> what do we got in here? 
I mean, it's definitely an item that exists. Ari, right, get him. Holy damage. <laughs> bye bye. There's so many crabs. Oh, all right. Oh, looks like we can use fire after all, Chow. You know, this is the second time in a row. The last time I found a fire aspect, I found one on Artie. And it sucked, dude. I want an Artie run, not Artie run, I want like a fire aspect run with a, uh, a high fire rate survivor, dude. But at least we got the sun, we got the, the orbs that do fire damage now, which is actually pretty sick. Let's take a look at her with the horns. It looks pretty sweet, dude. We do have one tank. I don't know how much it's going to help, but this is fun. How do I want Lungus? Yeah, I'll pick it up. I don't know if I want Void Scent, really. I don't really need it. Uh, I don't need that anymore. Go back. Yeah, it turns out we were playing Flame Artie the whole time. Um, yeah, I am actually going to take another one of these, I think. Yeah, let's do it. There's a lot of equipment on this map. Let's see if we can pull something good, like a gun or a recycler. Dude, that fire sack is actually insane right now. <laughs> we're we're doing damage. It's doing a lot more than I thought it would, actually. With the uh, the tendrils from the bomb, it actually helps to get a lot of those stacks in. Hey, man. Hey, there it is. What up? Let's do this first. Perfect. I'm gonna recycle this into a gun, easy. And no chat, you can't recycle aspects. Okay. So what recycle an aspect? Chat always asks immediately. That is chat's first question every single time. I get a recycle an aspect on one stage. Raise your hand if you were thinking it. That's a fun build, to be honest. DML? New. Not the dole either. Can you use the spot of the aspect to reroll? If an aspect dropped on this map, then yes, you could. Flash Hour would be actually so fucking good on this build. Like, if I didn't have an aspect, that would be the number one equipment I'd want, I think, actually. But we have an aspect, so get blasted. Go try shop. That's true. But I rerolled the card way earlier, which was sad. And no. Will I say it? Absolutely not. Dude, Plimp with this build would be sick with the uh, the aspect. Or even a pilot. You gotta go for it. Don't give me banned. Nice. Needle tick. Um, uh, how'd that do with death mark? Fire, needle tick. Mm. What do I want though? A key? I mean, I guess. But I mean, it would be good. Mm -mm 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 -mm. That's so good. I definitely don't want more Rungus, so... That's fine. I hate this spot. We got this spot last time, too. Almost. Oh, that's awesome. Come here, dude. Neural? That's sick. I love that. Imagine getting a Murph, get like the true fire build. Nice. So we'll let death mark. Huge reroll, actually. More shuriken, that's actually pretty good. And goodbye. Out to the sunset, dude. Let's go. Pizza is gonna be kind of annoying with Artie. We don't really have that much move speed. We don't have feather, so we kind of either have to stay on the ground or we have to stay far in the air. And either way, it's not like fun. Ignition tank. Okay. Now we're moving. Brain socks. Wrong. Hurricane. Not bad either, but.
Reckler, Harpoon, Answer. Holy shit, that burn damage. A little bit too high, dude. Every time he gets frozen, by the way, he shoots out things, so... Dude, we had like 30 stacks of ice. <laughs> or fire, sorry. I'm just thinking of ice in my head. Should have taken a Neil Tick to be honest. Ow. <laughs> Not ideal. That's what I'm worried about. <laughs> hey. Ow. Jesus, I needed that boost forward. Got him. That was not good. <laughs> Alrighty. Dude, look at that fire, dude. Oh, the poly loot. Look. Jesus. That is so stupid. <laughs> 